Hey guys, this is Malinki. Welcome back to my channel, Voice of Malinki. Today we will talk about applications of mutations. And if you are new in my channel, please subscribe my channel. And if you like my video, please do like, comment, and share my video. Mutation is the process by which genetic variations are created through changes in the base sequence within genes resulting in the creation of a new character or trait not found in the parental type. So mutation generates genetic variations which create new characters different from parent. Mutation has certain applications in plant breeding. It is possible to induce mutations artificially through use of chemicals or radiations and selecting and using the plants that have the desirable character. This process is called mutation breeding. Suppose you want a disease resistant plant. So you can induce an artificial mutation by inducing mutation you can alter a particular gene of the target plant which was previously responsible for the susceptibility of the disease. The gene is now mutated and a plant becomes disease resistant. Mutation breeding is preferred when the desired alleles are absent in germplasm. Again, let's take the same example of disease resistant plant. The desired trait you have induced after mutation was not present in any of its parents. So, the desired alleles are absent in germplasm. It is commonly used to produce traits in crops such as larger seeds, new colors or sweeter fruits that either cannot be found in nature or have been lost during evolution. So these characters are not present in any of its parents or lost during evolution. Plants created using mutagenesis are called mutagenic plants. In this process, mutation is induced through biological, chemical or physical mutagens to develop desirable characteristics of a plant. Uh, so, in our last lecture, we have already talked about different types of mutagens. Mutations occur in such low frequencies that large numbers of seeds must be used, grown and bred over different generations until a desirable trait is developed. C. Since induction of mutation is an artificial process, its occurrence is very uncertain and only few plants could be mutated in this way. Hence, we have to work with large number of seeds. From 1930 to 2014, more than 3200 mutagenic plant varieties were released. Many important varieties of crop plants have been produced by mutation breeding. Now we will talk about some examples. So in Mumbai, resistance to yellow mosaic virus and powdery mildew were induced by mutations. Powdery mildew is a fungal disease that affects a wide range of plants. Sharbati sonora, this is the wheat variety, it is an example of mutation breeding. Sharbati sonora was developed by the gamma irradiation of a Mexican variety sonora 64. Pusa larma is an improved variation of wheat. It was developed by irradiation of larma rozo from Mexico with gamma rays. 
so this is all about today's lecture i hope you liked the lecture if you want to get the pdf notes of this topic please find the first pinned comment or the description box thank you